Hey folks, welcome back to Manor Lords. We are in Samwise, and we've got an angry two over there. Fuel. Okay, we need to get that going. But we also are in hot and heavy into the harvest and planting season, and need to make sure that everything's working properly. No more mistakes with the, uh, the rotation system. So, flax to fallow over here, there, there, and not. It's like this one didn't rotate. Interesting. Fallow flax, you too. Flax fallow. I kind of wonder if we want to just turn crop rotation off and do this manually each time. Can't really trust the system. You are correct. You are. You are done, right? Now we're we're sowing, and barley and sowing. Okay, these were to stay fallow. Uh, that would have been emmer. Yeah, and Barley, this group, and that group. Emmer's out over here. That's all correct. So, over here, Wheats. These would all be Wheats. And that's the one that failed, but we're, we're up and running again. These are the Barleys. Everything looks good. Okay, so you're good, and we are really hurting on firewood. Now, we could be buying firewood. I'm trying to think of ways, things to buy from Gimli that would help them out. Um, but otherwise, firewood is... What's well, right? We tried something different with firewood. That's right. So you need to turn on. And he was over here. He was... That's the marketplace. Did I move him already? I might have. He's deeper in now than he was before trying to remember. I think he was right there. Yeah, okay. So he's gone. He's deeper in. He doesn't have anybody in there, but that'll be okay until we can start emptying out some of these farms. You ended up with what? Okay, you are just two extra families right now. I didn't actually move any livestock in, and it's kind of too late to do that now. So that'll be fine. Uh, got a plow going over here. You're going over there. Though it looked like you were running to catch up with your uh, your ox. <laughs> One's going over here. Someone's going to wander this way, right? That's not a that's not an ox. Um, there's one more ox somewhere. I don't see you. Okay. One, two, three, four. No. Well, he's in there somewhere, or he's on his way, or. He's, he's moving through trees right now to get there or something. Anyway, so firewood is going to be a thing. And doing this, and when that's all done, then we've got 16, 17, 18 families that can be dumped into the system, which gets our, our trading posts all up and running and all of those new orders from last time of all the... Uh, all of the full trades that I've set up throughout the system. Actually, not as many as I thought. Um, all the foods and two of the uh, of the the wheats or the the, the what is the general word for the plants yeah the crops there we go anyway yep yeah, that needs to be worked on um gimli i need to spend quite a bit of time with today but i think samwise is up and running enough i need to find a few more families over here to get these trading posts stocked we're not in planting anymore. In fact, we're completely out for the season. This is recuperating. We're fallowed out. So I need to find some more families. One to get the uh, nine wheat. All we have is nine wheat. Is it worth it? It may not be worth it. Let's leave. Let's not put a family in the windmill. There's only nine wheat, and we can be bringing bread in directly from Samwise, and they have a lot of it to give. Uh, mining pit, you are the the clay, and you are done. You're gone, and you're out of there. Clay is now gone off the map. Great. And I need to make sure somebody is at least in here. So, probably hunting is where I need to go. You are where? Crafting. Hans, where are you? You're over here, so we need to get rid of your hunting. Peter, I need you to stop hunting. You are... Yeah, you're, you're mesmerized. What are you doing? <laughs> 
I hate to just take... Yeah, that's right. My saves I set last time for five minutes. I'm going to undo that. Gameplay. Let's go back to 15s. All right there. That that stutter is going to freak me out every single time, so let's not do that. Do I sacrifice these guys and shut him down? I don't know, but I'm thinking that we could shut down a family in each. Food, meat is 300. We have meat, yeah, going crazy. So let's just do that. And you're not supposed to have somebody in there that's running a booth, though that might have been someone's home booth. Let's shut down one family in each of those. We'll leave you up and running. You can probably just go away, but I'll leave you there for now. Anyway, that takes care of getting a couple more families. Let's put one of those families each in there and in there. And are there any more? Do I have logs? That was a stumbling block before. I don't. So timber we need more of. Then I can start upgrading all the level 1s to level 2s. And you're right there, and you're three families, and I still can't keep enough logs. What is that all about? Planks are pretty intense. One family's in there, none are in there. Storage is empty, storage is empty. So you're making planks out of logs. Ha. Huh. Where are you guys grabbing your logs from? I wish there was a way of knowing that by clicking on this and seeing where it was previously set. Um, I did tell them to go across the street, didn't I? I think they were working in here. And we do have a log down on the ground there, and there may be more of them around, so we'll leave them Oh, wait a minute. Work area is empty. Okay, that answered that question. So let's take out some more. Let's see. Am I there? I am there. Advanced. You. We do have the one log on the ground, so let's just add a little more triage over there. Triage. Yeah. Not to be confused with triage. How about we tell the forester to work on reforesting this area? And I don't know where you were working before either, but this area is going to need it. So we'll just keep replanting and then taking them down. Okay, so we've got one more in each of these traders. We want to eventually fill it up and maybe eventually even want a third trader. I don't know. They'll all kind of piggyback on each other and, and get all the goods moved around. But they're working... This is looking a little bit better. We're, we're down to one field left to plow, still in October. So I think we're okay over here. That's going to be a problem, but as soon as the farm's empty, we can we can load up one, two woodcutters, three woodcutters. There's another one there. Yeah, so we can get all, we got six families bringing a firewood. That's going to come in fast. Okay, so Gimli needs a lot of help. Gimli's our newest town. And you did get connected here, or you got built. So let's road from here. Well, we could travel. Nah, let's let's leave that alone. You're gonna come in like so. And any reason? Nah, I don't know what's gonna go in here. So I'm not gonna use that space. We're just gonna do that. So you are connected, and you are at communal oven. You're connected. We're in November. Let's peek at this real quick. So, funds from treasuries moved over. Uh, tithings deposited. Exhausted. Mining pit exhausted. What are you? You're clay. So, clay is now done in Gimli as well. Great. You are out of there. You are demolished. That should leave a log. Yeah, left a log. And now we have an extra family. Good. You are the corpse pit. All right, we'll leave you alone. Um, this new trading system of making... You are the same thing, right? Okay, same thing. Why did that just pop up again? Odd. The new trading system depends on having a lot of families to be able to move goods around. Where am I? Right here. So that we can move the most basic of goods back and forth between everybody and so that every town has what they need but Gimli needs a lot more although we last we left last episode at 15 coins so it is functioning yeah it I haven't done anything to help them out and they're already getting ahead they need to buy more than they have to sell they need a little of everything they're not manufacturing a lot of goods like the other two towns are so in that case and there are certain things I didn't ask to be brought over here 
there's no point in bringing flax over here. They're, they're not going to be tailoring. They're not going to be uh, weaving. Um, they can bring the, the gamesons over from here or from here because both of these have extras. And you are telling me something important. Work area is empty. You're out of trees. Let's set you real quick while I'm here thinking about things. Oh, I want you... Click, click, click. There. Advanced. You. Where's a logical place to grab trees? And I don't need to take another peek at that uh, wildlife area over there. Let's just take this group out while I'm until I figure things out. There's only one family working and we have we have enough timber to get ourselves going. Okay. So you can be you can be doing that. Um though last time we noticed that the deer weren't in the the area here. Oh that's right, they they were here. Because they looked like the rocks. Yeah. So it wasn't here. Was it Gimli? It was Gimli. Because I didn't know where to start taking they, uh, no, they're back. He was Gimli, and they're here now. Okay, interesting. And it's a rich deposit. Was that a rich deposit before? I guess it was. It was It was animals and mining over here. Same with over here, which was frustrating because we couldn't really specialize both. Um, so, have you returned? No, you have not. That was right in here. So you're walking through. So we found them over in here last time. And kind of swing around. Uh, pull back. Um, I don't know where they are. Oh, oh, there's one. There's another one. Okay. So the deer, hello. The deer over here now. Okay. We could I'm, I'm i'm not in gimli working anymore but you know I, I rabbit trail a lot they do still want to drop to a king's road and move in we added roads over here trying to make this work not realizing there wasn't a deer over there so let's just throw some roads in over here let's say you guys need to new farming area a new hunting area from here in like that you tap it and you, berries, ooh, you're going to go the long way around and tap it. Okay, and from here, where does that, that ends right there. We'll just kind of snake you through the woods, and right in there is a the deer. Okay, now, did my road cause the deer to flee? I don't know. I threw a road into here, uh, click something. But we, I had followed that road many episodes after that and, you know, saw the deer that were, that it led the hunters to. So I don't think the road's affected in that way, but I guess that's a possibility. But just in case we do get somebody, oh uh, no, we'll just, we'll just try that one road. Okay, so maybe that will help them out. Um, I'm not in Gimli. Again, Samwise. Gandalf, there we are. Three families now. And, oh, we moved over to November. So did I miss anything else that was real important? Uh, construction finished on a large storehouse. Okay, let's get a family in there. You can be traders. Yeah, oh, they're already... What? Finished on large storehouse. But that was finished before... Oh, I upgraded. Okay, okay, okay. That makes a little more sense. All right. Anything else that needs to be dealt with? Burgish Plots Brewery. Samwise Construction Finish on a brewery. On a brewery. I must have level 3'd it? Tier 3'd? Maybe that's what it was. But anyway, I think we're done. Are we done planting by now? No, we're still sowing. Okay. No, it's growth. No, we're still sewing. Okay. All right. Ignoring everything but Gimli now. So what I'm trying to get out, <laughs> having a hard time doing it, is that Gimli needs more things to sell. And they're going to be specializing in iron and armor and weaponry and what have you. So their trading is geared a lot toward selling all of the items. So that was a save. I need to make sure that we have got that 
you know that that foundation of an industry up and running this was the bloomery i do have a family going in there what have we actually created from that we have 18 iron slabs to get us going and we are done we are not done okay um 100 100 100 and 100 oh that's right can i do that here tab well, I don't know if that means it's planted. It, just, it starts growing as soon as you put your first seed in. So that doesn't necessarily mean that I could have got that information from there. Um, so I don't need these guys in here. We don't have anything left to be threshed. So I can get rid of all of these families. And Gimli is back up and running again. What does that mean? Trading for one. Let's put another family in there. And... Well, let's see. One, two, three, four... Yeah, okay. That still leaves us is seven. And they gets their trading industry fully up and running. We have a person here. Do we need a person here? We're asking for three more horses now. Okay, trading post, advanced, asking for one in there. Apparently that one horse last time just kind of wandered away. I, I didn't see it while I was recording. I only saw it when I was editing. That one horse is just kind of walking his way over here. And I don't know why that is. I don't know what caused it because there were families in the trading post. Why they didn't take possession of their horse, I don't know. There was someone in the livestock trader, why they didn't deliver the horse, I don't know. So why or how, you know, what, the reasoning behind that, I have no idea. So, and you are level two, I need you to be a level three so we can get more families in this plot over here. I need to get the other trader set to accept two horses you and you oh it didn't bounce away this time when i when i uh hit that 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 click interesting so you are ready to accept two more horses that the livestock traders are going to bring in and we still have seven families left i want to get somebody starting to work with let's see what do we need to do we already have basic armoring done so do we have another point we don't click 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 okay so i need an armorer and that would be these two. Let's go ahead and make that happen if we can. Right there, yep, that's good. I'm gonna start constructing that. We need four planks. And how are we doing as far as that goes? 34 timber and 85 planks. And we have plenty of roofing tiles for other expansions. Have we expanded the church here? Wooden church, no, so you could be done as well. Let's get you going. We have, oh, that was a long pause. Whew. We have six families left, so you can be doing that. I'm thinking by clicking the upgrade, we've already taken a family out who's now going to be not going to be in the pool anymore. They're going to be here. All right. And for that matter, it's two families that we're going to be doing this with. Um, I'm going to want a armor, and I'm going to want a blacksmith. May as well just get that going. Um, we'll wait to do that one later, but let's get the blacksmith going right there. Okay, yep, there's five, so I did do it immediately. So you guys are going to begin to use the iron that we need to get back into producing. So let's get at least two in there, and let's see bloomery was hiding in this area two families are in there already and i have a feeling we may as well just go ahead and set up the second bloomery now is there a logic as to where that would be near here near where it's going to be stored i don't know if they will walk right to here and grab the iron ore or hello that's right you're being built so you are a storehouse from gimli and you are needing to be upgraded okay so you're going to grab the iron you guys are going to smelt it all right, that's, yeah, that, that works. So let's get another smelter going on. Industry, bloomery. You're right in there. Get rid of snap. Do I want a road wandering through? We don't have a road in here at all, and we have no room for one. So that's probably a thing, a road in there. So let's set you more along here, and it opens up between these two buildings like that. So that's where the, uh, the entrance will naturally be. It's probably something along these lines like that but i don't see why we can't also give them some shortcuts depending on which direction they're coming in all right so two are going to go into another, another bloomery 
We're going to still have three families left to rebuild these guys, bring over the planks or whatever was needed, and get our industry going. I'm seeing winds. We've got a thunderstorm brewing. Can we see black clouds on the horizon? Boy, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Nope, that's not a thing yet. Oh, we that's right. We have a, uh, we have a troop over here. If I double-click, there we are. So Gandalf's retinue still sitting out here at attention. And they are keeping the lands safe. Just thinking about the livestock trader over here, which made me think of sheep. So 10 sheep and 11 lambs. We have, over time, purchased 10 sheep and 10 lambs. So apparently the two original sheep made one lamb, but no lambs have yet matured to become sheep. So let's get through this next winter. It seems like I have seen sheep through two winters already. I'm just trying to remember back seeing those, those two sheep that were here and it was in the snow. And I'm pretty sure there's been another winter since as we've been adding more of these. So with that, this next winter finishing, negative 31, we should be at at least two years for those original lambs. I think we originally bought two sheep and two lambs to see if they're actually going to grow up or not. There was talk of there being a bug and sheep. Lambs do not mature to become sheep, but I need to actually verify that, so we'll, we'll give that some time to figure it out. Yeah. Just just looking at this right here. I was over in Halfwit Brit's current episode, and he had made a comment about the boat in the backyard of someone's house, and I've called that a boat too. It sure looks like the ribs of a boat. They just haven't finished the bow and the stern yet. Maybe a flat over here, and a, there's a curve coming in over here, but then uh, uh, Peter rode in and says, you know that's a wagon, right? And now that I stare at this, yeah, okay, there's an axle. Now over at the houses, there are wagon wheels kind of sitting around, which is kind of a Kind of like a, a duh moment, but um, it, it looks like a boat to me. So, <laughs> but yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, it's a it's a wagon. All right, but it's interesting how they chose this design as this this you know uh, debris you kind of sitting about instead of chose this design, which is something that's actually used in the game or a smaller version here. So it's odd that we don't have these running about and we've got that was a negative 50 something a positive 50 something and a negative was there a 40 something a little while ago so goods are moving in they're moving out they're moving in they're moving out and that's what i was hoping to see all right so we can pull that off lightning storm is on its way in how are we for the families over here can i officially say we're done now let's check it out this way they all have numbers slash numbers zero slash numbers and over here good luck finding them but they seem to all have a similar pattern three of 56 over here so you are sown and you are definitely growing is there anything that doesn't look like i don't want to pass over all the numbers but i'm just glancing at that bar i'm guessing everything is completely finished but a 99 sure looks like a 100 but I'd have to... S oh, you're fallow. <laughs> There's no bar there. Yeah, you... I gotta, I gotta hunt and search for that pop-up. Doesn't always hit. Lightning. Okay, so I'm thinking that... These are the two that were, I think, the last ones. You were probably the very last one. So I'd say we're done. Alright, so you were late. Let's see if we actually see the pop-up. So, well, not that something's on fire but something just went straight to rubble that's what it typically does uh that's a trading post so actually let's just fill you guys up you're there and trading post you're there okay i wanted to get to this farm which the trading post and the farm and the tavern and you yeah, know they all kind of blend in and look the same to me at times you farmhouse you do have wheat interesting you were so late I heard a big noise, but I didn't see no assigned family to guide the ox. Here, okay. Um, you're so late, and yet you managed to get wheat put away in you. Interesting. So you will need a family. I'll just take all that out but one. We don't need a 
a whole army, a whole regiment working on those. Although having a regiment here, a retinue of, of farmers, sure did the job quick. So you're done over here. So you're all done. And we have got a whole bunch of peoples. We are herding on firewood, so let's just make that happen first. You, Woodcutter's Lodge, two in there. Stocks are getting exposed in Gimli. Supplies, we... Three clay are sitting out here. Oh, so not everything got brought in. This is Gimli. There are... We could put one more person into the storehouse. Even though I want some them to be building or constructing. But still, I think that's okay. We'll go get that. Um, anyway, we're getting firewood up and running over here. Clothing stall. And every time I start talking, I, I stop looking over there. I'm curious to see if I can actually notice a fire... A uh, lightning strike. You do not need to be a thing. Although there was a need for that now that I think about it. Yeah, turn you on. There was. We didn't have enough firewood stalls and so the houses were, were fighting that. So if I put two families in each and give you all firewood stalls, then there'll be plenty of extra family members to continue doing the job. So we have six families bringing in firewood. I don't think I've ever in the you know, life of this series, had six families in one town bringing a firewood. So we should see this rocket up pretty quickly. Food is still happening. It's time to make it happen more, though. You need to go to work, and I want two of you doing that. Right? No, one of, one of you. Nobody has to do any hauling because it's all automatically being brought to advance to here. So these guys need to do the hauling. Right there, and two of you back into there. That one's important. I raided the granary and the storehouse pretty heavily when I uh, needed farmers. But you also need to go in, and just like that, we're out of workers again. Yeah, and there's nobody in the, the dye workshop. There's nobody in the weaver's workshop. I stripped all those out. So I still need to go back and find more families and distribute this a little bit better. But you're almost done. Seven more and you'll be out of there. And I did get you. Farmhouse. I did not get you. Take one more out of there. I only need one left. Okay. I thought there was only one in there. So, okay. I Okay. Little, little brain damage there. Okay, so you're functioning enough over here. Did I miss it? I did not miss it. Gimli requests more market area space for their stalls. Gimli. You're over here, and who was requesting that? The trading post is requesting it. I don't need stall workers in the trading post. So that is a no. Not this trading post. This trading post. Minus all of you. Put all of you back in. And so that's, that's a no. And that is a no. All right, you guys just concentrate on trading. I don't need you distracted. So you're trading. Money is over here. We're fluctuating up and down. We're at 104. We've got the potential for industry happening. We've got... I need. I really could use some more builders right now. Let's do that. Take one of you away and one of you away. Yeah, I've just got to thinking if I put one more in here, I can get the... Uh, yeah, Samwise running out of fuel. I can get those uh, horses in here that much quicker, right? You're all going home or you're waiting? Advanced. Uh, trade. I did set you. I did. So there should be three of them out there going to get some of these. Huh. And I had a thought earlier and I never got a chance to put it out there. It's going to cost them 30 to bring sheep over here. Same with... I think same with Samwise right there. Trade, sheep. It's going to cost them 30. Over here, it costs us 25. Right there. And there's a hey, plus one. <laughs> so trade, sheep, 25. So I would say that um, Gandalf needs to be trading, bringing in sheep. 45 sheep. Boom. And then they need to sell them at a reduced price over here to Samwise and save them the coin. That seems like a neighborly thing to do. So any changes in the numbers? Oh, yeah, we just had another lamb. Okay, so we're making lambs. 
We're just not growing them up. So we were 10, 11, now we're 10, 12, and that was not a purchase. So trade, yeah, we had called for, we originally got two and then we got eight more. So this can all go away, um, no trade. And let's bring in 30. Gandalf can afford it. And we'll bring 30 lambs in. And it'd be nice to put another person in here to make that happen a little quicker. I don't know how I can afford that though. Um, armor shop and blacksmith shop are all done over there. Okay, so we'll go pop over there real quick. Royal taxes have increased. So next year's taxes are starting at 475. Okay. And the music just died. Boy, that was sudden. And December just happened. And... Did we just go to winter music? I wonder. That was an automatic thing. So, yeah, December just happened. Winter is officially started. The All of the agricultural stuff has ended. And we've already cleaned up this one and that one. And this was long since done. So we're completely out of harvest season now. Good. Uh, firewood stalled is finished in Samwise. Okay. So Gimli was needing more stall space. And Gimli needs more housing anyway. Housing, we're full over here. We are, we have one house left over here. We're bringing in only one. No, we're probably bringing in two a month now. It automatically drops when you lose that, that top row of green pluses up there. So we do need to think about that. We need to grow more families over here. We've grown families over here. So we're good now for berry season. And we can tap this area for... for I thought I just heard thunder. No. Something, oh, windmill. Windmill? Windmill. No, windmill's not going. Um, do we need a windmill? We do not. Why don't we? Next harp. We, we harvested these. Oh, is it still sitting a farmhouse? Wait a minute here. We harvested these. All that came in. We didn't sell it. Trade on wheat is set for... Actually, I haven't set it over here. Okay. Because I figured there was nothing really to do barley-wise or wheat-wise. We're going to trade in linen and we're going to... Or, or actually the clothing. And we'll trade in alcohol. Because they're going to be, by then, loaded in armor richness. This should be uh, one or two thousand before too long once all the armor gets going. So wheat, we didn't trade it out. So where did all their wheat go? We're not running this. I've never turned this on that I remember. We just built it. But we harvested all of this. So when it swapped itself out accidentally, did it delete all of the crops that were in the field? I'm a little concerned about this. I am. Um, turn you guys off. And let's just turn rotations off. I'm not liking the rotation system anymore. I'm going to shut you down. You as well. I think that's a thing until that gets rethought. It's, it's too random. October hits and it undoes everything that we were just doing in September, and in this case, it was everything. We're ready to replant everything. So you, no more crop rotations. You're going to be manually reset, and maybe between episodes, I'll go in and do that same thing for all the other places too. But I don't know where our wheat went. This was all Emmer. And I want, see right now you just, yeah. So Emmer, we used up all the fertile lands were followed now and all the wheat came in it would have gone to the farm it would have been turned into food 92 grain it got done it did get done okay so it got done when I didn't realize they had finished their job and there are eight families in here still and that not only they got it done somebody got it moved that must be what is going on. Actually, no. It's not sitting there. Where's the grain? Did, did, it didn't get taken all the way up here to the berry area, did it? 
No, 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 it didn't. Where's the grain? So that's what's confusing me. It didn't all get moved into here. It all got moved in. Who moved it into there? That's wild. I don't know that these buildings distribute. They only bring to themselves. These people would have had to go and get it. And yet somebody brought it over. That is fascinating. Okay. Well, let's put one person in there. Let's put one person in the communal oven. And let's get food coming in. Um, we were hurting on food, weren't we? Now we're five months still. So we're okay here. Okay. So we, this episode, are getting more iron ore made. There's a hundred of it now. We are getting... Uh, right there, iron slabs. We were at 18, now we're at 13. So now we're going to start using it pretty heavily. So, this guy is waiting to get built. You're in the highest priority. We have two families. We have more than enough goods. 12 of 10 planks. Interesting. And I just need a family to get over here and do it, right? We just need some tap, tap, taps and we're done. So, who's on their way? You're hauling a... An ox. I don't see any families on that road. What you guys doing? So I need that built. I need the other bloomery built. Um, here. And I need all those stocked. Because we're about to run out of iron ore. Or we grab extra iron ore from the other towns. We're set to do that. So that's, that's the idea. When one is out of something, we're over here... How did I set that up? Iron slabs. I want to maintain 100. So when Gimli has more than 100, it's welcome to full trade in-house. Move those iron slabs out to whoever else needs it. Um, just set you. And this sure looks like a Gandalf. But now that there's snow, I'm really turned around. There we are. So you guys over here set you like so. Trade and commodities no uh what are you called crafting iron we're calling for 100 over here as well we have one okay so they can't buy from them that's for sure and they won't be doing any buying from here because samwise is not set up for that so a trading post you yeah so trade there is no iron. there's no bloomery over here so you won't have any being sold or bought you think about that. You, iron slabs, yeah, you're not even part of the system. Alright, so it's just those two. Gimli, which has the rich iron deposit, and Gandalf, which has the rich iron deposit. Still 12, almost 1300, and still over 1700. So I'm not going to worry about the deep mining for a while. Let's just keep working down our, although this is Gandalf. One, two, three, four. Five, so I only have one left. So I think we will deep mine Gimli only. And let Gimli supply both from their mine. And maybe I, I wonder, can you put two mines in one one deposit? I wonder if you can. It's worth checking out. Um, <clears throat> so I might give... I might not. I don't know what I'll use that other point for over here. I haven't figured that one out. But it is snowing. It's getting hard to see. And what else needs to be just kind of cleaned up over here? I think I might make this a little shorter episode. I just got back from a trip. I didn't sleep much last night. And I'm amazed I've been able to maintain this energy level. So what is being built over here that I need two families? Unless it's the families that were responsible for things like moving the grain to the, the uh, windmill over there. I don't know. But we got a second bloomery going over here. And you do have somebody in there. Um, iron ore. 48. And one slab. Let's put a second one in here. And then when we get another person, I guess we drop you into here and get another person going there. Though if I do this, it'll tell me if anything's building. Because it'll give me a, an angry message. Did we ever get any fires from that last one? We did not. We did get a request for a stall from the trading post, and we turned that off. But that means we do need to set up another market area <clears throat> in Gimli. So, and I want to set up some more houses. 
I was thinking about that before. Okay, so this area here, we've logged this out. Let's set up some houses over in here and a, another market area over in this area. So houses, just hit the H and grab like here. Let's go up a little higher, right there. At an interesting angle. There, out like so. And swing you around like that. Will it tell me if there's trees that've got to come down? It will not. I know this would have to drop. That is a huge tree, but it won't. It won't warm me, so I'll stop like that. And we don't need vegetables back here, so these smaller backyards are fine. Though something's freaking out right there. Oh, when I cross that line, the backyard goes away. That's not nice. Okay, do that. It does not like it when I do that. Interesting. Let's start over, go from here to there, and go this way. What happens if I do this? Yeah, I lose the backyard. I wonder if it's a steepness thing. It could be that... No? You can see the contour lines are not that aggressive. It just it takes the backyard away when you... Of both of them. Wow. Does it give it back if I go further? It does over there, but it doesn't over here. Huh. Alright, so just be aware of things like that. And I feel like I am losing my voice. Minus, let's put doubles over in here. Sure, we'll do that. And I like the doubles because it allows two families to deal with the eggs or the, the, uh, the goats or what have you. So I've seen them grab their basket and go deliver eggs. So that way two families are responsible for it. And I don't know if two families and one big chicken coop brings twice as many eggs that's possible i'm watching half wit brit's episode when he was showing the honey that he added more families and suddenly he had more honey in the system are we in samwise no so there is something else that i could be doing over here i just kind of forget these exist um in fact you're right here hit no hitching post hitching post okay grab you um it was over here there you are apiary so honey in the system surplus honey is five let's put you in and the other honey was over here near the farms kind of in right that area put you in all right so we'll see if later we have more than five surplus in the system but back over here we put some houses in we need to put gimli we need to put a couple more spaces for market stalls in this area and you could be where we have four market stalls over here one two three four we have housing over here we have no road through here we have a road over there you are a forester's hut okay so in and around you isn't really anything other than just well i'll say bushes but i think the bushes would show they just yeah so there's nothing here but grass um you are a logging camp that doesn't really work it's over here it's it's here if i can not take out that tree so housing and marketplace and let's do we can run a road up through here it does make a sense to run a road through here too though let's do that first and we'll figure out where you go later so you're up in there now marketplace and let's just grab the, the little bit of space that's left, looking where it grabs the dot. There's two next to each other. You to there, and do something weird like that. That's seven. That's one. Okay, let's go here. Boy, I wish this this black box here was, was more transparent. Let's go here and go up at an angle. There's three. Let's do that. Three is, is plenty for an area. We could put three more over on this side. We need to put something up in this area too. And it kind of makes sense that it's up in here. We have a store, oh, a storehouse. The granary is over here. I need to communicate these areas to each other. I do, you're the main road. You need to work your way around and come back into here. That makes sense. You are a what? You are nothing. You just look like you want to be something. Like that. Okay. There's no upgrade for the well, right? Right. It just seems like there could be a stone well that would go in in place of that kind of a system. Let's road from here and 
kind of follow the, the woods and work your way straight in. Yeah, we'll go straight in and save. And then we'll also kind of swing around and join this area. All right, we got a, a true <clears throat> fork in the road. Oh, a, a trident. <laughs> so, marketplace, and I think I'm about done. Two families left to do any construction. Is it this end? Is it this end? This end gives them access to here a little easier. This end gives them access to here a little easier. Maybe it's both ends. Um... You could be one more interesting lot in here. Let's go more toward here. You and marketplace there to something like that. Let's go a little higher. One or two. Okay, let's go a little deeper. Though I don't know if it will do anything with that. You, there's three. We'll do that. You're there. And we'll go ahead and put three more at this end over here. Um, that's a long way to go without a road. It is. Let's run you across. Where you go afterward, I don't know. Do you go into there? Do you run along the backside and there's more houses in here? Do we have more houses here going uphill? I don't know. That's long-term planning and my mind is not there right now. So let's just throw a marketplace in and, and future-proof this area before I forget and throw more houses in and these guys have no access to foods three more you're right there perfect so what else do we need to finish up did you guys ever get a horse uh livestock you did not you are asking for them do we have a family going to get more horses you're here three two families and they're all waiting what's happening here <clears throat> what am i missing mules horses only in house that's what i'm missing okay now we could do that same thing we can import you yes let's do that we're going to import you in house and you're going to save a little bit of money because this one is going to bring them in at a discount you're going to full trade and you're going to bring in no you got to have that checked so you're going to bring in a total of eight. Now, how does that work? So we're going to foreign trade in, but we could foreign trade right back out again. So we'll have to just kind of watch that, see how that goes. But in-house can grab from you, foreigners can grab from you, but you can go out to foreigners to go get them. Okay, so you're going to grab some 25 coin horses. Hopefully Gimli is going to buy some of those from us. And then we'll shut this down at some point when we forget all about it and we suddenly are, are in the horse business. Okay. So with that, I'm losing my voice. I think I'm going to call this one done. Thanks for watching, folks, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye now.